Dear Honorable Judges, Thank you for the opportunity given to me. My name is Anna Agong Kutishikawiralesari and today I'm going to perform you a story. The title of the story is Bullying. It was Monday morning, Lisa was sat in her chair at classroom. There's a woman group coming up near to Lisa. The member of the group are Chiara, Amita, and Sarah. They are so beautiful and come from well families. Most of students are really admiring them because of their popularity. Everyone knows that the group always annoying Lisa, but they pretend not to see anything because they don't want to get problem with them. Lisa was bullied because she come from poor family. And actually, Lisa is a smart girl and success get into the school by using scholarship. Hey Lisa, come here! Yes, Chiara. I want you to make our homework because we are so busy yesterday, right? That's right. I was busy doing my modeling school yesterday. Me too. I was wearing Amita yesterday. I don't want to hear any excuse. Just take it and give it to me after break. Okay? Okay, Chiara. Lisa took the book and started writing it in her chair. Lisa can ignore them because she's so scared. There's a time when Lisa was trying to ignore them, but they spread bad rumors about her family. She's so scared and feel alone. She got corner, kicked and beaten up, and there's a time when they lock Lisa in the bathroom. There's no protection or help from any other. One day, a terrible experience happened to Lisa when her mother died because of tuberculosis. She had broken and hopeless. She want to give up, but she remember about her mother last word that she must become a successful person and promise her mother about that. Thus, she tried to study harder to get scholarship abroad. Look who is trying to study harder. Lately, you quiet calm, right? Are you trying to ignore us? But still, Lisa doesn't open her mouth and keep writing. Then, Chiara grabbed Lisa pepper and peel off the pepper. Lisa look at their face and get up. She's really ignore them and go to library. One night at 12 o'clock, something bad happened to Chiara when she want to go back at her home after hanging out with Amita and Sarah. At the time, Lisa was working. She looked something weird because there's a lot of people on the road. She coming closer and she's shocked because she saw Chiara. She quickly brought her to the hospital. After that, she go back to her home. Time flies and they don't bother Lisa again. Lisa proved her promise to study abroad and now she's working in cafeteria and making money by herself. When a customer come in, she start stop working because she's shocked. Hello, welcome to Oh, you are working here. 
she saw Chiara with her glasses. But honestly, there's a complete silence for a while. Ah, yes. Do you want anything? Oh, one Americano, please. Okay, wait a minute. Oh, Lisa. Can I talk to you? I'm busy. Please don't disturb me. But just for a moment, please. All right. After a minute, Lisa back with Americano and start sit down in front of Chiara. How are you, Lisa? Uh, as you can see. Uh, thank you for what you did a couple years ago. Ah, about that. It's okay. We are all human, right? We must help each other. Ah, uh, yes. We must help each other. And I'm sorry for what I did with my friends a couple years ago. Honestly, after doing something bad to you, I couldn't sleep well. And after I learned the importance of mental health, I'm really thinking about my behavior towards you. Chiara, what you have did with your friends in the past is something that I could never forget. Even until today, I felt insecure and scared if I had a friend. But I do forgive you as what you have did change me become a stronger person. Lisa, you are so kind. I'm sorry for what I did. That's alright. Oh, anyway, where's Amita and Sarah? Ah, about that. I've just called them and they're on the way here. Ah, glad to hear that. After that, Amita and Sarah arrived and they both apologized to Lisa too. Then they laughed and talking together. Finally, they become a good friend now. Now, what is the moral of the story? Bullying should be stopped for many reasons. It has terrible effect for bullies victims. It's led people to suicide and traumatized with anxiety, depression, and low self-esteem. So, stop bullying. That's about the story. I hope you enjoy and get the message. Thank you.